For the second year in a row, Infinity is making significant changes to its QX60 midsize luxury crossover SUV. Following last year's mid-cycle update that spruced up the QX60's jelly bean styling, lightly revised its interior, and improved the three-row crossover's chassis dynamics, Infinity's massaged version of the Nissan Pathfinder enters the 2017 model year with a new 3.5-liter V6 engine under its contoured hood. Dubbed VQ35DD, the rejuvenated engine shares less than half of its parts with last year's V6. Horsepower is now rated at a stout 295, and torque rises to a healthy 270 pounds to foot, gains of 30 and 22. A continuously variable automatic transmission again shuffles torque to the drive wheels, which are either the front two or, as in the example tested here, all four. Although we'd prefer a traditional planetary automatic, Infinity's CVT is a generally agreeable unit that imitates step shifts when heavy throttle is applied so as to avoid engine droning. Furthermore, a dedicated manual mode gives the driver seven preset ratios to swap among, while a dial on the center console tunnel offers four driving modes, standard, sport, snow, and eco, the last of which engages Infinity's intrusive eco pedal on QX60s equipped with either the driver assistance package or, as installed on our test car, the deluxe technology package. The Eco pedal works by adding resistance to the throttle, thus discouraging the driver from exercising a heavy foot. We generally left the QX60 in the standard setting, although we occasionally switched to Sport for its slightly sprightlier throttle response. Sport mode also brings a tendency to rev the engine past 3,500 revolutions per minute, where there is indeed more power accompanied by noticeable coarseness. At the track, the QX60's overhauled powertrain carried our 4,654-pound test car to 60 miles per hour in 7.1 seconds, 100 miles per hour in 18.0 seconds, and through the quarter mile in 15.5 seconds at 93 miles per hour, gains of 0 0.7, 2.4 and 0.5 seconds compared with a 102-pound lighter, all-wheel drive 2013 Infiniti JX35 we previously tested. The QX60 was known as the JX35 before Infiniti changed the name for 2014 as part of a Q-based rebranding scheme for its entire lineup, passing power saw a similar improvement. With the QX60's 30 to 50 mile per hour and 50 to 70 mile per hour runs requiring just 3.8 and 4.7 seconds to complete, besting the earlier model by 0.5 and 0.2 second. In spite of the engine's additional grunt, EPA fuel economy remains unchanged at 19 miles per gallon city and 26 miles per gallon highway for QX60's equipped with all wheel drive. Front wheel drive models, however, see city fuel economy fall from 21 miles per gallon to 20 miles per gallon, while the highway rating stays unchanged at 27 miles per gallon. No matter the drive wheels, Infinity asks that you feed the QX60 premium fuel. We averaged 20 miles per gallon during our time with the crossover, or 2 miles per gallon short of the QX60 AWD's EPA combined rating. Last year's suspension tweaks marginally refine the crossover's handling. Body roll is less pronounced and overall grip is improved, with the QX60 recording 0.79 grams around our skid pad, 0.03 grams better than the 2013 JX35. Even better, bringing the QX60 to a halt from 70 miles per hour required just 177 feet. 4 feet less than the old JX35. For comparison, a 397-pound lighter, all-wheel drive Acura MDX circled our skid pad at 0.82 grams but required 185 feet to stop from 70 miles per hour.
damn phones, Babylon's can't